Hey guys, let's see what Tox plays. Today, Tox plays Hearthstone and steps into the arena. Hi guys, Tox Trawis here, and I'm jumping back into the arena. Um, normally I would go with Priest, but my last arena run was also a Priest, so I'm going to go with Hunter this time. I know they're not usually particularly well known in the arena, but um, I feel more comfortable going with a Hunter than a Rogue. So, Hunter it is. Alright, so right off the bat we have some uh, um, League of Explorer card here. I kind of want to try it out. It's more likely to actually uh, get to its death rattle because there's less likely to be silences in uh, Arena. So I kind of want to go that. Um, but taunts seem nice. This uh, isn't horrible right off the bat, and it can get pretty good. Um, and I feel like in Arena, people are typically going to, typically, uh, typically going to pick uh, cards with Death Rattles, because Death Rattles tend to be uh, pretty decent. Because on Mystic could also be good. Um, but I'm, uh, I think I'm going to have to pick one of these two. And I think... I think I'm going to start with Low Exorcist. Alright, out of these three, I think Piloted Shredder just wins it. Um, I don't have any synergy mech-wise yet, so I can't rely on Gorilla Bot. Uh, Brave Archer, good, I guess, but not... I, I, th I think Piloted Shredder is just going to beat it out. Um, tracking could be useful. Uh, extra draw is always nice. But I do feel like uh, Trog is going to be nice too. Um, less removal in general in Arena, and uh, and Trog can get pretty uh, pretty powerful. So I think I'm going to go with Trog here. All right. Um, I think uh, Gurubashi is is the winner here. Neither of these are particularly. Great Warden's not. Uh, River Crocolisk is eh. I think the Berserker is the one. Desert Camel. I don't have any one drops yet, so I don't want to pick that. Uh, tracking. Or Scarlet Crusader then. And... I don't know. I know draw is good, but I, I hate having to discard cards. Um... I suppose in an arena deck, it's less detrimental because you could end up with cards you don't really want in your deck anyway. So I, I'm going to pick tracking because I feel like it could really get me out of a sticky situation. Out of these... I mean, it's draw. 3-2 isn't horrible. So I feel like King's Elk is going to be better. I don't have a weapon yet, so I don't want to get Spiteful Smith. Snipes, okay. But I think I'm going to go with King's Elk. Uh, Ram Wrangler, do I have beasts? I only have the one beast so far, so I don't know if I can rely on this. Um, I feel like in Arena, usually the board does not get that full. But... Uh, in this situation, I think Mind Control Tech is going to be better than Light Warden. So, I mean, I could hope for another beast, but I, right now I just don't have enough to justify it. So, Mind Control Tech. Charge is always nice. Healing's nice. You know what? I think Dark Scale Healer. I think that's it. Better value uh, for better trading. Web spinner. Uh, I don't have any one drop, like one mini, one drop minions. Arcane shot could be good. Boulder fist ogre. I don't have any high drops yet either. Um, I feel like web spinner's got some value in that it's got like extra draw built into it. But I think my issue last arena run was I didn't have a lot of high drops, so I'm gonna pick uh, boulder fist ogre here. Yeah.
Um, bomb lobber. I mean, misdirection, sure, but I think bomb lobber's got just nice value. Um, Maiden of the Lake could be useful here. I kind of like that. Just get extra two damage off for one mana each turn. Yeah, I'm gonna go Maiden of the Lake. Another King's Elec or Tracking. Either one's draw and Deadly Shot. I think removal's good here. I don't have any removal yet. Um, other than Bomb Lobber, I guess. Out of these, um, I still don't have any one drops. Normally, I think I'd rather go Silver Moon Guardian, but I'd like to get a one drop. Sniper's kind of nice. I don't want Sinaga Witch because I don't even have anything really over five yet. I have just Boulder Fist Ogre. Twilight Guardian, I don't have any dragons. So, I mean, a 2 6 for 4 isn't horrible. That's the same as uh, uh, Maiden of the Lake. This could be useful, though. The hero power. So, or his, uh, his ability for that effects on hero power. Uh, Hunter's Mark, I think, would be useful. Yeah. Um, I have no secrets, so I guess Amani Berserker, Salty Dog's just too likely to die before it gets to do anything. Don't need two Hunter's Mark. I think Unleash the Hounds might be useful. Although, again, in Arena, I feel like there's going to be less uh, minions on the board, so I might not get as many out. Uh, actually, the extra draw might be better. Although, Unleash the Hounds would go well with the Hunter's Mark I have. I feel like draw is just especially important in Arena, though. Um, yeah, I just I don't know how effective Unleash the Hounds is in Arena, so I'm going to pick uh, Acolyte of Pain. Another thing of removal. And I think that's better value than these two. I like Animal Companion a lot, but I th I need more big drops. Um, so I'm going to pick Dragon and Crusher. Call Pet isn't worth it. I don't have many beasts. I have one beast. Um, Ruby and Egg isn't bad, but I have no activators, I don't think. Uh, so I think Explorer's Hat is the best um, best option here. No weapons, so this doesn't get any cheaper. No weapons, so this doesn't get charged. And I only have one, one drop. So I guess Holy Squire it is. Uh, Mookla's Champion could be really good if I have minions out um, but if I don't have lots of minions out it's not really that effective on the other hand I can get two minions out in one or I could uh, do some better value trading with the dark iron dwarf I think I'd rather that's tricky I think I'm going to go with the silver hand knight I'd rather just get more bodies on the board I know Dark Iron Dwarf's good. Um, I guess I'm lower on four than five drops, but I just want... Uh, extra bodies, I think, will be better, being able to split the damage up. And also, I just need higher drops. I mean, it does make sense, I guess, if the lower mana's got more value, but I, th I feel like this will be better. Uh, another tracking. Spectral Knight. I think it's Spectral Knight all the way. Um, just really valuable. Can't be targeted. And it's a uh, pretty heavy 
hitter, at least, con especially considering what I have right now. I don't have a lot of big stuff, so Spectral Knight. Uh, Houndmaster, again, I don't have any beasts. Um, and then my other two options are beasts. And I feel like while well, Oasis Snapjaw is okay, I feel like being able to discover more cards, just adding more cards to my hand is really beneficial, even if the 4 for a 3-3 three, three isn't that beneficial. So, Tune Spider. Here's a weapon. Glaive Zooka. Ooh, I could use Cult Master for draw. Um, spell damage isn't going to be useful, so it's one of these two. I feel like weapon's useful, but I think having that extra draw might be more useful. Okay, we've got a bigger trog here. Um, I think I'm going to pick him. 3 for 4 4 is not bad. Well, Ogre Brute might not be bad. But I have less 4 drops than 3 drops. So I'll pick the 4 drop. Uh, 4 more cards left. Beast of Charge. Again, don't have that many beasts. Gain Wind Fury isn't horrible. I mean, Brave Archer is more likely to be activated in Arena because you're more likely to have less cards. But I feel like the Rider is going to be more useful. I wish I had more beasts because I think Tr Tundra Rhino would be decent. I just I only have what one, two beasts. That's it. So Dragon Hawk Rider. And she just really wants to join my team. Um, I'm not getting high drops. I think I don't have. I don't need spell damage for anything. I don't, I don't think I have anything that does damage as a spell. In fact, I just don't have many spells at all. Um, I don't feel like. I I guess brave archer is useful if my hand is empty. I just. Yeah, I'll do that. I guess it's more likely to happen in a uh, in a uh, an arena game. Um, don't have any pirates. I have one drops now, so Desert Camel might be decent. I'm getting so many low drops. Um, I think I'd rather just get two bodies out early on. Yeah. And this is my last pick. I don't think I have many mechs. I'm not expecting Goblin Sapper to be useful. I think I have just the one mech. Ooh. Yeah, Pouted Shredder. And that's it. So this doesn't make too much sense. I guess it's a 3 3 for 3, but I think I'm going to go for Misdirection. And that is my deck. So, um, this is just the deck building video. And uh, next episode, we'll have my first game. So, if you want to see how this deck fares, uh, go watch the next video. Hope you enjoyed my deck building. Thank you, as always, for watching. Talks out. Hi guys! Thanks for watching this episode of me playing some Arena in Hearthstone. If you like this episode, feel free to give it a like or drop a comment down below. If you like my content, I'd love a subscribe. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Talks out.